rhinos. Hi friends, today we are going to learn all about rhinoceroses. If you want to read along with us, you can download this lesson plan from our website at learnbright.org. What is a rhinoceros? Rhinoceroses, rhinos for short, are fascinating creatures with a unique set of physical characteristics. One of their most distinctive features is their tough, grayish, and wrinkled skin. This skin helps protect them from the elements of their environment. Underneath this rugged exterior, rhinos have strong, muscular bodies that allow them to charge at high speeds when they feel threatened. In short bursts, they can run up to 30 miles per hour. Perhaps the most iconic feature of rhinos are their large, pointy horns, which are made of a material called keratin. Like our fingernails and hair, rhinos' horns keep growing throughout their lives. They use these horns for various purposes, including digging for water and minerals, defending their territory from other rhinos, and sometimes even protecting their young. Sadly, these impressive horns have made them a target for poachers who hunt them for their valuable horns. In some cultures, the horns are believed to have special healing powers. In addition to their unique skin and horns, rhinoceroses have short, stocky legs that support their massive bodies. Their legs are well suited for running when necessary, but rhinos are generally known for their slower, lumbering pace. They also possess fairly large, expressive ears that can swivel in different directions. Their ears help them pick up sounds from their surroundings, alerting them to potential dangers or to the presence of other animals. Rhinos usually live in savannas, grasslands, and even African and Asian forests. They like to be where there's plenty of green grass to munch on. Sometimes they take mud baths to keep cool and protect their skin from the sun. The impressive beasts are solitary animals, so they usually live alone. But sometimes they gather in small groups, especially when a female rhino has a baby. When caring for their little ones, rhino moms are very protective. They use their muscular bodies to keep their babies safe from danger. Baby rhinos, called calves, stay close to their moms. While in their mother's care, they learn how to find food and stay safe in the wild. It's like going to school with their mom as their teacher. What do rhinoceroses eat? Rhinos are herbivores, which means they have a plant-based diet. These big, strong animals mainly munch on vegetation like grass, leaves, branches, and fruits. Scientists consider the rhino both a browser and a grazer. Grazing refers to when rhinos nibble on grass and other plants on the ground. But they also browse, which means they use their strong lips and teeth to pluck leaves and branches from trees and bushes. You could think of them like the giant lawnmowers of the savannah. And they're not too picky. If it's a yummy plant, a rhinoceros will try it. A rhino can find food in various places because it lives in multiple habitats. From grassy savannas to dense forests, rhinoceroses have a keen sense of smell, which helps them locate the tastiest plants to chow down on. So whether it's a grassy meadow or a leafy tree, rhinos are experts at finding their favorite snacks. Other interesting facts. One of the most interesting things about rhinos is their thick, tough skin. It's not just for looks. Their skin is like armor, protecting them from scratches, insect bites, and the harsh sun. Scientists call this unique skin dermal armor. Rhinos also have incredible hearing as well to help them detect sounds from far away. This sharp sense of hearing keeps them alert and aware of their surroundings, even in the densest forests. Scientists have discovered that a rhino's horn continuously grows throughout its life. It's not just for defense either. A rhino uses its horn to dig and even show off to other rhinos. Some rhinos, like the Indian rhino, have one horn, 
but others, such as the African white rhino, can have two. Rhinoceroses also have thick, strong legs that help them carry their massive bodies around. And their feet are like padded, cushiony bed slippers that are great for walking silently through the wilderness. Why are rhinos important to the environment? Rhinoceroses are incredibly important for the environment in several ways. One of their most essential roles is shaping their habitats. They keep the landscape in balance by munching on all sorts of vegetation. Believe it or not, if there are too many plants, it could negatively affect other animals and even change the whole ecosystem. Sadly, many species of rhinoceroses are endangered today and at risk of disappearing from the wild forever. This is mainly because of poaching. Poaching, or illegal hunting, has caused a severe decline in rhino populations. Some people hunt them because they believe that rhino horns have unique, almost magical properties, even though no scientific proof of this exists. The horn of a rhino is used in traditional Asian medicine. However, it is increasingly common for people to display a rhino horn as a status symbol to show their success and wealth. Conservationists and scientists are working very hard to protect these amazing animals and their habitats to ensure that they continue to positively impact the environment. Wow, rhinos are pretty rad. Let's review to see what you remember about them. Choose the word the author would say best describes the rhinoceros. A. Shy B. Scaly C. Solitary D. Minuscule E. Predator C. Solitary Why do rhinos take mud baths? To keep cool and protect their skin from the sun. True or false, rhinos are not an endangered species. False. Well done, rhino experts! If you enjoyed reading along with us today, head over to learnbright.org for even more fun lesson plans. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.